Kirby, um... Kirby Simon. Simon. Yep. Now, this is an interesting matchup because uh, nobody has fun. Uh, Simon doesn't have fun because Kirby doesn't get hit by F-Tilt and, like, half your projectiles and zoning Whoops, I accidentally opened Discord, fuck. Oh, no. <laughs> Luckily, it's set to, uh, window not display. Okay. Force of habit, you know? <laughs> What music? Surely we're gonna finally see Donkey Kong Country Returns both. Surely you do the Ooh, Pig Step. Oh hell yeah, let's go Pig Step. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Shoutouts to Pig Step. What's the uh, Lana Rain? That's the name of the artist, right? I think so. Yeah. Or well, Lana Rain. Have you ever gotten Pig Step? Huh? In Minecraft. Yes. I got it twice in a row from the same bastion. It was so annoying. It was the first one I got in the world. It's my hardcore world and oh man. I wish I got a better one. Or oh, another unique one. I mean with the uh... Small battlefield for game one. Mm -hmm. This is really interesting because usually Legacy doesn't like to go to Small Battlefield because Kirby with the Battlefield platform heights, uh, he gets his forward throw combos messed up. Oh. Which is why Kirby doesn't like Battlefield. And as you saw there, Kirby just pancaked under down angled back air. That's, it's a very uh, interesting thing about this matchup is you'll, yeah, you'll see the uh, the Belmont use a lot of down to it just because it covers uh, Kirby's crouch and not many other things do. Yeah, I can imagine. You really have to be quite preemptive about a lot of your, um, uh, a lot of your options. Yeah. Because yet again, <laughs> down angle back here is a scam. <laughs> So oh, trying to get the nail, the but he's gonna get um gets hit the with the back air that time. Mm, Hundred and six percent on Paul Bowler at the moment, which is definitely yep. still another Ooh. thing that's important about this matchup is that Kirby Kit is really good at edge guarding the Belmonts. Yes. So that means the off stage is really really scary, but uh, for the Simon and uh, Richter player, but. At the same time, being on stage is really scary for Kirby, so it's a really volatile matchup. It really It is. really depends on whether Simon can um, easily keep the Kirby out. At least that's yeah. in at least that's what I see. Yeah, it's Feel really, free to disagree um, with me, resident Richter player. Simon player. Both. But um, yeah, it's a it's a matchup where it's it's pretty slow paced because uh, Kirby's gonna kind of slowly come towards you because they can't just run in because they're gonna get hit when they're running by forward tilt and other things. So they kind of have to sort of slowly crouch over to you. And yeah. Another thing that's really important to note in this matchup is that Kirby's got a really slow airspeed, so it's really hard mm. for him to avoid Simon's projectiles. Yeah, which means Kirby has to be very grounded in it. And well, Kirby already has to be really grounded, yeah, but that's just yeah. exacerbated in this matchup specifically. Ooh, try, ooh it's the down angle it. forward air, and that's going to kill him really easily. Ooh. Oh. Ooh, really, nice. really good movement coming out from Paul Bolo here. Just being able to. Oh, he caught the bottle, but nothing comes out of it. So, so it feels like such a wasted opportunity when they get hit by holy water with the crosses uh, on the ground because you get no source. The cross comes in. The cross isn't the holy. Legacy's struggling to get back on yeah. stage at the moment. This, He's just getting hit. That oh, wow. That was an excellent conversion yeah. coming out from Paul Bowler. Taking the lead. Now, 
we're probably going to see a uh, relatively sort of flat stage because um, uh, we're getting we're getting PS2. PS2, yeah. The platforms are high, which means the higher Kirby, Kirby. than they are than they are on uh, small battlefield, which means that Kirby will be able to do his forward air combo, like his forward throw forward air combos more easily because the platforms won't affect his ability to do that. Mm. So therefore, that means that Kirby will be able to rack on more damage and hopefully that would make that is going to be the difference in this matchup but we'll see yeah it's it's definitely an interesting stage because um it makes the zoning game for simon just that much easier because you have so much space i believe it is the biggest stage in terms of grounded air like i think town i think town is slightly bigger ps2 might be bigger no i think town is bigger because it's also flat you gotta keep in mind yeah I think, yeah. Anyway, very, very flat stage because. Um, ooh, ooh, ooh yeah. he, he snipes ooh, the tether, but he's being able to. But um, Paul Bull is able to get back to stage, and now mm. Legacy is off stage again. Doesn't quite get the shield break. Holy Water not uh, landing on the ground again. Such an inconsistent move. Getting a back air there to, to take him out, and he's going to die. die. Yeah. He's just gonna die like that. That some, was really. Some would call that a homie stock, um, but as they say in the industry, we take those. And... I think that Legacy just made the best out of a misplay because mm. I think that that down air was a miss input. Yeah, quite likely as well. Ooh, um... he's getting he's getting the the back airs. These back airs are really really scary for Paul Bowler. He gets the. Ooh. Very good jab lock coming out from a, Legacy here, and now he's in comeback. the lead. Yeah, fully in the lead. Now he's got his uh, in the blender. It's such a hard situation for Simon because you just kind of have to up be out of it and then, hope that the Kirby gets hit by it. Yeah. Ooh, Doesn't missing get the, the holy water F smash. Yeah, missing People that F that's smash, true, but, he's but um, off stage now. Skill issue if you get hit by it. Ooh, Ooh. missing the sweet okay. spot on the forward air, which Kirby means that he's stage. still alive. This is really good for Legacy, if he can get some more damage on. Ooh, missing right the up B, but he's not going to get a punish out of it. His Nair drag downs are not quite true. <laughs> Very sad. But, uh, okay. So, cross. Cross is very good against uh, coveries like Kirby, because if they go over the ledge with their up B... Ooh, Legacy attempting to go for a suck and cuff, but he's going to get killed for it. 63% on Paul Bowler here. This is well, absolutely, stage, this is absolutely winnable, but Will not if not if he's gonna kill. He um, recovers. Ooh, Ooh but he, air. but Legacy's Ooh, still going, and he's jump. gonna get the forward air. Absolutely, wow. absolute gaming coming out from yeah. Legacy here. What a great edge guard. Yeah, recognizing just the limited options that Simon has in that situation. This is what Legacy is going to want to do for the rest of this set. Yeah, it's it's a game. It's a matchup where Kirby just has to punch. Yeah, you need to, you need to be taking one hundred percent of the op, of the opportunities that you have, and you need to be pushing them to the absolute limit. You need to, yeah. Once you get in, you gotta make. You you gotta make it. You yeah. you, you gotta make it uh, last for as long as possible. Smashville. Smashville and the very interesting because Kirby platform doesn't mess up stuff. And the uh, the platform can also mean that uh, it's going to be slightly easier to fight and get the hits on Richter. But yep. this is, is an amazing stage for Richter because that back air and it's cross just, just kill cover so much of the stage. And it, may, and it means that uh, the Belmont's kill power is going to be even better on this stage mm. because of how small it is. And there's less space to run away from Belmont's as well. Yeah, so if... Because if... Uh, Kirby ducks under the cross. The uh, the Belmonts, they've got that cross in the field now, and that's that's just going to be there and covering like pretty much the entire stage. And some really, really good ledge trapping coming out here from Paul Bowler. He is really really good at hitting these ledge traps, but the Legacy is really good at these edge guards. He's going to get that down air. Ooh, down, down smash, smash coming out to cover the roll, but that's not going to kill. Not even close. Down smack, very weak move, but 
It's, and it's pretty big, so yeah, it's you, pretty you can't massive. really. It's mad. It is. Yeah, you, you can't really complain about a big move, even if it's not Kirby the strongest move. Kirby taking the, uh, the cross. It is a very good option again when you're up close that's against. Mine. Um, oh, that's yours. Mine left mine right next to you. Sorry, my bad. Very good option against uh, like Belmont like up close because they just don't have any options so that um, hit them. I don't have a sticker small enough. <laughs> All right, very even game coming out here for game three. This is really exciting. Um, ooh, ooh, he's just gonna almost situation. die there to the F smash. Really good recovery though, coming out from Legacy, and now he's on stage and pressuring Paul Bowler off stage. Down to catching the. The, the thing about this, the thing about this matchup is there's hardly any neutral. It's always it one person in advantage and one person in disadvantage, and yeah. it's up to you to decide who is in what position and it seems that legacy is going to immediately take yep. back that stock and it is um, back to even the yeah. only time that they're only doing yeah oh good job dropping shield knowing that that is a shield break setup yeah he that, yeah. that was way better for him than getting shield broken because he would have died yeah there's yeah there's some uh, large amount of because uh, because he was next to the ledge that was a pretty much guaranteed holy water down there down there yeah something like that and um good job recognizing dropping shield oh legacy's gonna hit get by hit the... by the axe and that's almost gonna kill him but good high Cross recovery the field, covering the um yeah, un unfortunately, Legacy looks like this. Looks like he's really struggling to get back to ledge. Ooh, Weird interaction first, um, with the inhale box. there. Yeah. Legacy electing for a lot of neutral getups, and I'm not sure if that's the right play. I know he can hear me, but mm. I should probably be a bit quieter. But shield, uh, ve looking very. That's gonna take it. Yeah, back air, gonna take it. Mm. Game three, two. Um. Mm. All right, Legacy's going to go back to PS2 for game four. He seems to enjoy the stage in this matchup the most. Yeah, yeah. Because you just have a little bit more room to get around uh, their projectiles. The, you don't you don't get boxed in yep. as a part of yep. the history. Surely we will see the Donkey Kong Country returns. I know he's going for a Gen 5 because Gen 5 is his favorite. All right, what are we getting? All right, we're getting the Swords of Justice, one of my favorites personally. Is that the one Keldeo's in? Yeah. Yeah. I think I watched that episode or mini series. It's the one it was a where... movie. Oh, it was a movie. Oh, it was... oh, but it was the one. There's the green one who's like a yeah. moose. Yeah. And there's a brown one who's, who's like a, a cow. Bull. A cow, oh, yeah. A cow. And then you got like the deer, who's the yeah. the blue one. There's a blue one oh, that's a deer. Oh yeah, it was it's like called a deer. Yeah. yeah, yeah. He was like a uh, with the grey like beard. Yeah. And then there was uh, Keldeo, who was like little, I guess a goat. Little horse. As a horse. Yeah. A, a little horse is called a pony. Anyway. Anyway. Into this matchup. Game four. Richter knows what a pony is. He's probably ridden multiple of them in his time. He's <laughs> from a, another time, in fact. Didn't know. All right. Oh, he's going to get the oh, Hollywood of the F smash. Richter. Seeing some up airs, juggling up, sends out. Okay, neutral get up. Yeah. Goes to the down air, misses. Now he's getting ledge trap. Doesn't get punished. Good death attack coming out from Legacy. He's off stage Hopefully, now, but he's uh, gonna get the nair. Polo, trying to get some extra. Doesn't get any. Very even. Yeah. Legacy's just really, really good at being able to even up the stocks. Hmm. Ooh, good up tilts coming out from Legacy. Putting him in the washer. He's done 26%. He's done like... 50% like, pretty much. Very Damn. good coming out Very from good. Legacy. Oh, footstool, no down air. Uh, love to see it. Guess the nair. Is this going to be a stock? Not quite. Okay. Off stage, Kirby recovering. What are you going to do? You've got those extra jumps, but what do you do when those run out? 
very, very even though. Mm. Oh, good down, down tilt air. Catches the dash I mean, good, away. good down tilt, yeah. Yeah. D down Doesn't tilt. Trips. The it's a very strong option when uh, when landing with Nair because you can mix up whether you fast fall or not and it just changes the time that you have to parry. So it's very, very good. Ooh, match. just missing the axe that yeah. probably would have killed him. Very Ooh, but that axe that will hit. Will. Putting him in a bit of a checkmate scenario. Couldn't really dash couldn't really... forwards or backwards because of the cross and the axe was just covering the air. Yeah, he couldn't really do anything there. Mm. All right, now, now he's just getting back in. Now poor Bolo's cooking with gas. He's got seventy yeah. percent. And doesn't care about the climate. Doesn't care about Kirby. But now he's off stage. And he's going to make it back. Good All back right. air coming Billy out from Paul. Gun. And he's going to get the gets weak the F tilt. Mm -hmm. Wish it didn't exist. Don't know why it does. I feel like a Rick. All right, good back air coming out from Legacy. 93% on him, no, though. Um, he's not in a very good spot. No noodle back air combos into F smash. <laughs> That's pretty funny. Yeah. Is it like at a kill percent? Yeah. Oh, wow. It's crazy. <laughs> it's like a thing. <laughs> it's so bad. Like Ooh, when, this when, could when be I heard really about it, scary. I went, I went into the training room to test it, and it took me like five minutes to hit the, week, the noodle back air. It's so bad. So hard to hit and so like Ooh, really mode. good. Oh my god, he's just evened up this thing. Oh, and he the gets the back air. We are going to a game five, ladies and gentlemen. Very epic. Probably gonna see either Smashville or Hollow Bastion. Yeah, probably. Very. Um, Can't believe that we've got spammers in the chat. Look, we've got one talking about crypto. We've got one we talking about. Bro, I, did, I thought those were extinct. I thought those were extinct as well. Yeah. Also, I have this new... <laughs> Alright, get in a Hollow Bastion for game five. Okay, good. Oh, actually, um, I was... I think my, uh, my mom was looking at, like, uh, Airbnbs for her dad for, like, something... Anyway, there was this uh, one she found in Sydney. It was called the Crypto Castle. <laughs> <laughs> Listed as the crypto card. That's crazy. It was right. crazy. Game five, going to Hollow Bastion. Pretty similar to Smashville, but with different blossoms. Mm. I wonder if the uh, the platform height uh, plays much of effect here. A little Kirby, bit. Um, a little bit for Kirby. It's the same height as Small Battlefield. Ah. Oh my God, he almost Not died to that, and he was at forty. <laughs> Ooh, the cross the wrong way, yeah. maybe. Overextension? Well, yeah, overextension for both of them. Good. Cross just covering the approach. Such a good tool in this matchup because even if Kirby crouches under it, Kirby isn't going to get a big punish because yeah. the cross is just going to interrupt any combos. Ooh, doesn't quite get the uh, edge guard. Alright, come on. Ooh. Down it. Ooh, still very even. Nobody's lost a stock yet. Yeah. Better hurry up. We've got other games to play. Yeah. Good back depth. Good back air coming out there. from uh, Pulp Bowler. Yeah. We've got a See? down throw for damage, and he's yeah. off stage again. Ooh, F tilt. Still catches the down air. And yeah. the homie Paul's covering Paul the uh, stopping the edge guard. Yeah, Paul's going to make it back, but he's just off stage again. Missing the back missing air. Missing the back air, yeah. Ooh, he's getting all these F tilts, but they're not quite killing because it's kind of stale. Ooh. But he's gonna just make an unforced error there, Damn. and that's back to even. But Paul Bowler is looking to <laughs> widen his advantage yeah, right 51 now. Fifty one already, and he's in the got the ledge trap. Ooh, good parry coming out from Legacy on the bottle there. Kept in the corner. Will he get back to center? Really, this is where it becomes difficult. Is just when the They've got the top platform to just cover your approach, and they're just throwing out cross and F tilt. Yeah, this is. And you just die. Yeah, this is really, really hard. <laughs> Doesn't take any damage, yeah. This is really, really, really hard, hard for Legacy at the moment. Up B. 
Legacy is going for a lot of neutral get-ups, which mm. Paul Baller is really taking advantage of here. That's some mid-set coaching. Uh... Not mid-set coaching. I'm talking about the set. Okay. okay. Ooh, snipes the jump. Doesn't get anything else it. All right. Air drag down. Up B works. Pretty much a whole stock in between these oh. two, but... The thing about Kirby is that he can kind of mm. take your stock at any percent because he's really, really good at, at edge cutting. We might see a second go. Yeah, I'd like to see that because yeah. that will definitely even up this game. Doesn't get the up here, damn. Ooh, Missed good up B coming out from Paul Buller. I'm not sure if the up would have killed the 99, maybe? What did he kill? Oh, but that will. Damn. Good holy water to S Smash coming out from Paul Buller. Very good game five set coming out from both of these players here. Mm. Good job.